Another big story this morning after some issues with NASA's uncrewed Artemis one mission heading to the moon. The launch has been scrubbed. Eyewitness News reporter Tony Cabrera joining us live in the newsroom with those details this morning. Tony Mark Rachel, even though there's still an hour and a half left in the launch window, NASA has scrubbed the launch due to an engine bleed they couldn't fix. Let's get to a live look from the launch pad at NASA's Kennedy Space Center right now in Florida, where a number of setbacks led to this scrub. Overnight, there was a weather delay because of thunderstorms offshore. We see some of those raindrops on the lens right there. Once it started to clear up, they started the fueling process, but then had to pause it again to watch a potential hydrogen leak. But the bigger issue was a crack in the inner lip of the tank. Although there were no humans aboard this mission, this was the first step of the Artemis program, which aims to return humans to the moon and eventually land them on Mars. This test flight was expected to orbit around the moon, traveling a total of 1.3 million miles over just 42 days before splashing down off the coast of San Diego in October. We've gone to uh, do a, a habitable rover so that our astronauts can get out of their spacesuits and roam around the terrain of the moon. Uh, all of this is in preparation to build and develop the technology to go to Mars in the late 2030s, 2040. Since the launch was scrubbed today, we're told the next possible launch would be Friday, but NASA hasn't said if the rocket would be ready by then. NASA says its teams will continue to gather data before announcing the next possible launch day. Live in the newsroom, Tony Cabrera, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Tony, thank you for the update. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC 7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC 7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.